What's going on everyone? My name's Obi and welcome back to Quartz Lab Financial. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any videos. And also make sure you hit the like button because it really does go a long way in helping out the channel. Today we're going to be talking about CrowdStrike Holdings, ticker symbol CRWD. It's currently 5.51 p.m. Eastern Time here in Michigan, and the stock is currently trading at $161.50, up 13.64% for the day, and up 0.19% in the after hours. So I've talked about CrowdStrike a few times on this channel before, and I talked about how I was invested. Well, today they reported their 2021 Q3 earnings numbers. And following the earnings report, the stock jumped nearly 14% today. Now I got in at about $90, so I'm up about 80, 82% in this position here. Before we talk about that, a quick message from our partner. The promotion that Webull was running is now extended to December 14th. When you open up your new brokerage account, you'll receive two free stocks. All new US investors will receive four total free stocks, including those two free stocks valued up to $3,700, when they make a deposit of $100. And lastly, cryptocurrency is now available on Webull so you can trade cryptocurrency with zero commissions. So let's talk about the earnings report. I thought it was a positive earnings report and obviously the market reacted positively as well. Revenue was up 86% year over year. Talk about a growth stock. Now their business model is subscription based and that's why we're talking about 2021 earnings and it's cloud-based cybersecurity. Subscription growth was up 87% year over year and that's what contributed to the revenue growth. In Q3, there's 1,186 new customers that CrowdStrike has on contract. So as of October, they have 8,416 net customers. Now the thing about CrowdStrike is Falcon is their flagship software. Falcon protects users from breaches at endpoints, and endpoints are the most common places for breaches to occur. The software also uses automated intelligence to hunt for threats and continue learning moving forward. But guess who uses a company like this? Companies like SpaceX, companies like Google, and many other big names. So that alone tells me that they're the best in the business. I have to believe if Amazon Web Services, which we've had on the show, is a partner of yours, well, you couldn't get a better marquee name. Absolutely. Uh, Amazon and uh, AWS is a great partner for us. Uh, as I talked about on the earnings call, we've got a lot of momentum with their marketplace. And we're protecting a lot of the world's leading um, workloads, whether they're in Amazon, Azure, or even the Google Cloud. I believe moving forward, sometime down the line, potentially two, three years, this stock could be a $400 stock. Now, obviously, that's just my prediction. It's a growth stock. It's growing at an insane rate. And that's what I think about it. Don't buy a stock just because I'm buying it. It's important to do your own research and come to your own conclusions. But with names like that, I believe that they're going to have a whole lot more than 8.4K customers. I said it before on this channel and I'm saying it now. Security is a needs-based business and software does well at scale. Gross margin is looking great. The margin here is 77% this quarter and it was 74% last year in this quarter. People were expecting break even this quarter. Well, they were actually profitable this quarter. Last year around this time they were losing money. Well, this year they turned an operating profit of $18.9 million. Last year at this time they lost $16.5 million in this quarter. Like I said, earnings per share was expected to be zero cents per share break even, but they actually ended up doing eight cents per share. So they really shocked the market here. Work from home is a trend that's here to stay. Even if people do start going back into the office at some point, these big companies are still going to need to uh, have their security maximized because there's still going to be times when people uh, don't have to come into the office and there's going to be more flexibility in the workplace, uh, in my opinion, of course. And of course, there's more and more places on the cloud now than ever. So this is really good for CrowdStrike. So high margins, strong balance sheet. They turned a profit this quarter. Um, $1.1 billion of cash and cash equivalents sitting on their balance sheet as of October. I really do like this play. I really do like this play and I might even double down on my position here. But anyways, that's going to be it for this video. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Leave me a comment down below. I want to know what you guys think and I'll link the free discord in the description below. As always, thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next video.